Every day in America, thousands of plants just like this one die a needless death. They die because of the growth of bacteria and fungi in the soil. But it doesn't have to be that way. You can join with me and realize that we can use steam to save these helpless plants from a bleak future. So band with me, use steam. So I'm cruising around the internet and I find this term called soil steaming. And I have to look that up because it involves steam and soil, now I'm, now I'm curious. And it turns out that people use steam to disinfect soil the same way that people use steam to disinfect other things. You might remember the episode we did a little while ago where cattle producers uh, were using steam to disinfect the carcasses of beef while they were hanging before they went into the slaughterhouse to reduce uh, foodborne pathogens. Well, bad stuff forms in soil as well, bacteria and fungi and stuff like that, and they use steam to kill it. Now, it also helps kill uh, weeds and the other spores that uh, help um, grow weeds, so it's kind of like a win-win. We get rid of this bacteria and we get rid of the weeds that are in our field. Now, as I do some research, it seems like it's really popular uh, in Europe, but it's also popular in the U.S. It's been around for quite a while. There's a couple of different ways to do it. They have these big hoods that go under the tractors and they kind of blast steam down. They have these uh, other hoods that have injection uh, spikes on them that blast the steam down into the soil. And it seems like the most popular is something called uh, sheet steaming. And that is a, a process where they pretty much lay a large sheet down over an area of soil and they inject steam under the sheet. Now there's some, some time and duration and temperature things that you can imagine would go on. So a lot of different ideas on it, but basically it seems like if you get around 200 degrees steam in there, uh, maybe one and a half hours to two hours of exposure, you need to be about 10 centimeters deep. At 10 centimeters, the understanding is you'll raise the soil temperature to about 90 degrees and this is going to kill the bacteria and the spores and the other stuff that causes all the bad things. So soil steaming, if you're not familiar with it, use it to kill bacteria and fungi that form in the soil so that plants can grow uh, healthier and with a better crop yield. You get some home gardening advice on steam culture. You don't get that anywhere else, but what you will get is some new content every week. This week, it was soil steaming. Look it up, Google it on the internet like I did. While you're out there Googling, look us up because we're out there everywhere, social media, on the internet. I'll be here next Friday with a new episode of Steam Culture. I'll see you then. Go do some gardening. <laughs>